The inaugural Bear Fest kicks off this weekend in Otonga County. The event is to raise money for Billingsley High School. Joining us now here in studio is Billingsley High School head football coach and athletic director Lanny Jones. And I told you a few minutes ago behind the scenes, congratulations on a first full school year there. Thank you. It, it was it was enjoyable. It's been a long year, but it, you know we we look forward to you know uh, the process of where we're trying to go and, and get there. You know uh, our our community and our parents and players have all. You know, they've bought into what we're trying to do. So excited about, you know, what the next few years hold for our programs. Now you're so. taking it a step further with this inaugural Bear Fest. Tell us what you have planned this weekend. Uh, we got a Bear Fest. Uh, it's, it's typical, you know, festival type thing where we're having a car, sh car show, truck show, tractor, bike show. Um, and then also with vendors, you know, with the crafts um, and anything else that people uh, want to sell, you know, from a, from a festival standpoint. So. Um, we have that going on from 10 to 3 uh, on Saturday, and then that night we have uh, Kirk J, who was on The Voice, yes. season 15. He, he's putting on a concert for us at 7 o'clock that night. So uh, it should be a big, long day of, of excitement and fun, and just want everybody to come out there and enjoy it. And this is all to raise money for the school, specifically the athletics department. Yes, ma'am. How important are those funds to you, and what are they used for? Uh, they're very important, you know, coming from a, a small community and a small school, you know, the resources are, are very limited with what we have. So, you know, anything that we can do to make money benefits our program by paying for, you know, the equipment that we need, uh, travel, uh, you know, officials are very expensive now. Uh, and just, you know, everything it takes for us to kind of give our kids the best resources available, you know, to upgrade our, our facilities and our and, and our and our players equipment for safety and top stuff so you know those are huge and so this was a great opportunity I thought uh, something they've never done before and uh, thought it would be uh, something that would be something we would continue to do every year so I hope you know this year will be um, uh, pay off for us you know as, as, a, as a program so I'm excited about it. I know it's a small community there but a very close community it have is. you had a lot of people coming out to volunteer and help Oh yes, I, 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 there's not a single time that I haven't asked for something or some help that somebody from our community hasn't stepped up and, and helped with. So, you know, they're excited about it and uh, so maybe everybody will come out. And, uh, you know, I do want everybody to know that it was originally at Billingsley School Grounds and it has moved to Whitewater Camp on US 82 uh, in Prattville. It's kind of between Prattville and Billingsley on 82, right off 82 there. So. Do Just, people need to buy tickets or register to attend? Yes, well, the, the, the festival part's free. We're just taking donations for the school for that part. Um, to register as a vendor or, or put your car in the auto show, that's 20 bucks. You can go to gofan.co, not .com, so people get that confused. <laughs> and then uh, the concert is purchased at the same place as well. People should be familiar with that website. It's yes. the website you yes. use to buy, to buy tickets to the game, yes, so most people should know. Remind us again, the location change, dates, and time. All right. The, the Bear Fest will be this, this Saturday, uh, June the 3rd. It will be at Whitewater Camp uh, in Prattville off of US 82. Uh, festivals from 10 to 3, concerts at 7 o'clock that night. And then the um, gates will open at 5.30 for the concert. And all of this is to go support those kids at Billingsley High School. Coach, Coach Lanny, thanks so much for joining Thank us you. here on Alabama Live.